when the Son of Man comes, will he find faith on the earth? Will he find faith? Remember what Ellen White says? Those who exercise but little faith now are in the greatest danger of falling under satanic delusion when the decree goes forth to compel the conscience. Great Controversy, page 621 and 622. Beloved, God has given us more truth. Brethren, if you want more information, if you want more information, just visit our website. If you look on the screen, brethren, the website, just take a look at the website and also go to YouTube. And you can see more of these prophetic studies on sigh and cry we must. My dearly beloved brethren, God loves you so much. May God keep you, may God bless you and help us to be like the Bereans. May God help us to be like those ancient Bereans. Because although they accepted the word with all readiness, yet they searched the scriptures daily to see whether those things were so. God has given us more truth, brethren. May God bless us. May God keep us. May God enlighten us. Because it was by a prophet that the Lord led the children of Israel out of Egypt. And by a prophet was Israel preserved. And God says, surely the Lord God will do nothing, but he revealeth his secrets unto his servants, the prophets. The prophets are the seers, brethren. First Samuel chapter 9 and verse 9, the prophets were called the seers because the prophets are the eyes of the church. God says in Malachi chapter 4 and verse 5, behold, I'm going to send you Elijah, the prophet, before the coming of the great and dreadful day of the Lord. Brethren, in closing, do you know that Ellen G. White commenting on that verse in Testaments to Ministers 475? Do you know that she says under the title, Let Heaven Guide? She says, somebody is to come in the spirit and power of Elijah. And when he appears, men may say you are too earnest. You do not interpret the scripture in the proper way. Let me tell you how to teach your message in black and white brethren what's so hard to understand about what's just been read there and just been quoted inspiration says because we say we believe in the spirit of prophecy spirit of prophecy says somebody is to come commenting on malachi 4 5 and when he appears men may say you are too earnest you do not interpret the scripture in a proper way let me tell you how to teach your message. Somebody is to come. And when he appears, just like Elijah the Tishbite, he went to the tribes of Israel. Just like John the Baptist, he went to the church. God says, I'm going to send another prophet. Ellen G. White is really saying to us, she was not the last. Because commenting on Malachi 4, 5, she says, somebody is to come. And when he appears... Ellen G. White is not a he, brethren. God has given us more light. God has given us more truth. May God bless us, brethren. Again, look at the website and go to Sigh and Cry We Must. There you will find many prophetic studies, brethren, concerning these last days. I hope the study today, brethren, has blessed your hearts. May God bless you and keep you. May God cause his face to shine upon you and be gracious to you. I love you so much, brethren. In Jesus' precious name. Amen and amen.